Hi everyone and Happy New Year. It is 2016 and to kick off the new year I thought I would start with doing my December favorites since I usually do them at the end of the month but we had quite a busy uh, holiday season. We were traveling down in Florida visiting some family and we took a little side excursion to Miami Beach which was really nice and relaxing and refreshing and I am really excited to be back um, in my home starting the new year with some fresh resolutions and all of that good stuff. I actually uh, one of my resolutions this year was to start a blog and I just put up my first post this morning so I will put a link to my new blog site if you want to follow me there at uh, have we will travel dot blogspot.com I think it is but I'll put a link down below and I hope everyone had a wonderful holiday season um, and I wish you all the best in the new year and I wanted to quickly before I get started just say thank you to all of my subscribers and anyone watching this video for tuning in and continuing to support me and my channel it really means a lot to me and I really enjoy being on here I love this community I think I've made so many great friends um, and that's where I'm gonna start with my favorites I've got a few things to share that that um, I'm really just so surprised and lucky to have received. I'm gonna get started with a few things uh, that I received um, last month and the month before. And so the first thing is actually something I had won from another YouTuber. It's Eva in the City. Hi, Eva. And um, this is a poster from a Chanel event that she attended in London. And it was really great. She did a giveaway on her channel and um, I was so excited to win this because where I live in Charlotte, North Carolina, we do not have any Chanel boutiques, let alone any types of events, fashion events and that kind of thing. So I'm really excited about this. So this is what it looks like. It's a poster. Um, and yeah, the exhibit was for Mademoiselle Trouvet and I absolutely love this. And I had just posted something on Instagram yesterday. I am looking for a frame, a perfect frame for this so I can put it here in my inspiration room. And once I do, I will definitely uh, show you Eva how it looks. And thank you again so much. This is such a, a thoughtful gift. And I have here also the, um, um, this is the bag that came with it, just a little tote bag and um, yeah details on the event where it was held and I'm just so excited because like I said I don't often have opportunities to attend these kinds of events and so this really meant a lot to me so thank you so much Eva and the next thing is another um, contest or giveaway that I had entered on. This is like such a strange month for me that I won twice. I never win anything. And um, I actually entered another giveaway from another YouTuber, Leo Lion LV, Linda. Hi, Linda. Um, she was giving away this beautiful Louis Vuitton item that um, she was so generous to even do a giveaway just to thank her subscribers. And I just loved what the item was. And I love Linda's channel. And I love, um, obviously, Louis Vuitton. Ton, and um, so I actually won this one as well and so I just received it when I got back from Florida and it came in this bag with a whole bunch of stuff that I just kind of threw in here but I have the receipt from where it was purchased um, a card there's also a Louis Vuitton card in here with the flowers trunk picture that I'm definitely going to find a way to display somehow in this room and then the item came in this box and I will just show you what it is. This is so, was so exciting and thrilling to receive this. And the item came in this dust bag. And it is the, sorry, opening it backwards. If I can get it out. <laughs> it is the Louis Vuitton card case. And it has this beautiful pinkish, the camera's not going to pick it up. I know Linda tried to get this as well, but um, it has kind of a, shimmery effect to the pink on here. It is so beautiful in person and this is my first Louis Vuitton card case so I was so thrilled to get this. Um, it smells absolutely delicious by the way and thank you so much Linda. You know I will be using this and thinking of you every time I do and um, I was just so thrilled to again win two giveaways in like the series of one month which is crazy for me because 
I, like I said, has never won anything in my life. And the last thing I had here from um, was actually a gift, a very unexpected gift from a friend of mine here on YouTube, Nettie Ward. Hi, Nettie. Um, she and I are going to be seeing each other next month in New York. I'm really excited about that. And um, the item that she sent me was this beautiful, this was a Christmas gift, and it was this beautiful um, little glass tray here that I am going to be prominently displaying somewhere in here or behind the camera. There's um, actually a little shelf that I haven't quite set up here. I love the gold. It is this zebra kind of stripe. Looks like a little um, animal print rug, um, but it's really, really cute. The gold and white theme is definitely something I've been looking for for this entire room. I'm looking at stationery and things like that. So this was just the perfect, most thoughtful, sweet thing. Thank you so much, Nettie. I am really, really excited to start using that. So jumping into just a few random favorites. I don't have too many this month because we were in Florida and it was kind of an unusual time for me wardrobe-wise because it was really really hot there especially in Miami and humid and I brought all the wrong clothes and <laughs> as I usually do um, and yeah I just didn't have too many fashion favorites but I do have a few beauty favorites and a few other things uh, to go through as well so the first thing I have beauty wise is a mask and this is from Glam Glow and this is just a um, kind of travel size that I picked up at Sephora during the VIB sale. And this one is called the Youth Mud. And um, I'll show you what's left in here. It's kind of gooey looking, but um, it is a mud mask that basically you put on your face, you let it dry for about 10 to 15 minutes, um, just let it sit and it just hardens, you wash it off and your face feels instantly refreshed, your pores are tightened. And um, you, I have been using it in conjunction with the Chanel mask. It is like a hydrating mask um, that I put on, but you could use any hydrating mask afterwards. So I kind of always do a mud mask first, tighten my pores, and then really heavily moisturize my face. And it just has been a dream. So absolutely loving this and will purchase in the full size soon. And then a couple of um, beauty products. The first one um, is lipstick. I'm gonna talk about some red lipsticks because all month long I have just been wearing red lipstick except for today, I finally switched into something pink. Um, but the first one that I have just been using all the time is NARS Cruella, and this is in the matte formula. And it's just a red lipstick that goes on, stays on, and I wore it last night for a New Year's Eve party and it was absolutely the most perfect thing. It doesn't come off on your drinks, it doesn't come off um, as you're eating. I mean, it's really hard to get this stuff off and it is amazing, so I'm really enjoying that. And then the other one I've been really loving, I actually got during the VIB sale as well. Um, I got this Marc Jacobs lipstick, which is, um, in the color, if I can read it, please let my eyes work. Yes, it's in the color Go Rouge. It says Go Rouge. Um, and it looks like this. It's a great, another great red and a semi matte formula, I would say. And it stays on really well. I love the packaging. This is just a little mini, but um, we'll definitely be looking to purchase this at some point. If it's not an exclusive color, I'm not even sure. Um, the next thing I have is a uh, Joe Malone. <laughs> Um, bath oil and this is in the red roses scent and I absolutely have been loving this I just recently um Oh my gosh, it's so wonderful. I just recently started uh, trying to take more luxurious baths and spend some more time just um, pampering myself at home. And this is one great way to do it. Um, I've used, you can see how much is used here. Um, that's from about two baths. You basically just need a few drops and it just infuses the entire room and leaves your skin so soft and um, you don't need to even moisturize after you get out of the tub. It is just absolutely wonderful. So that is the Red Roses bath oil from Jo Malone. Loving, loving that. And then the fragrance that I have been absolutely loving this month is my Coco Noir from Chanel. I just got this in December and have been using it at all the holiday parties and things that we have been attending. And I wore it when I was down in Florida and I absolutely love this scent. Uh, my mother-in-law actually commented when we stayed with her that um, after we left and went to Miami that our room just smelled like um, <laughs> it just smelled like Laura, she said, and I said, that's my perfume. And so basically it just leaves an aura of Laura <laughs> everywhere I go, but it's a beautiful, beautiful scent and um, a little bit strong, um, but perfect for the holiday. 
Okay, and the next thing that I have been absolutely loving, my favorite gift from Santa this year, is my Louis Vuitton agenda in the MM size. I had to include this in this video even though I really haven't started using it yet. I have just been um, setting it up and getting things to put inside. I'm still looking for the perfect pen. I had done a video um, showing this when I got it and showing my Kate Spade planner pages, but I also got a few, um, I got this little Chanel um, gift for the holidays that had some uh, stationery and I actually cut down the stationery to fill up some space here and just kind of see what it would look like to have kind of a gold and white theme and this was just a little card that came with it but um, and I've got a pen here from L&M just as a placeholder until I find the perfect pen but um, absolutely loving this and um, cannot wait to get started using it. And the last thing I have to show you is, of course, a handbag. I always end with a handbag. And the handbag that I have just been using nonstop the last month, over the last month, is my Chanel Wallet on Chain, or Walk. And I have it in the black lambskin leather with the silver hardware. And I have just been, I, this came with me to Florida. It came with me to all my holiday parties. came with me last night for New Year's Eve. It came with me to Miami. It was the perfect bag in Miami. It actually, we got a little rained on. It got wet, no problem. Um, it actually just wears very, very well. And the lambskin is getting softer and softer. And I'm just absolutely loving this bag. And it is the perfect travel companion when you, just need to take a few cards, a lipstick, and you know your room key, and that's about it. Um, but it is a great holiday bag. It's a great bag for going out to parties. It's a great hands-free bag. I love the versatility of it. I love that you can use it crossbody, you can use it on your shoulder, or you can just tuck the chain in all together and use it as a clutch. So my favorite bag of the month definitely would be my wallet on chain from Chanel. So that's it for my December favorites. Um, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. And I wanted to, once again, just wish everyone a happy and healthy 2016 and uh, thank everyone again for all of your continued love and support here on my channel. I love all of you guys and I will see you all soon in my next video. Have a great day, bye.